Brendan, tell us about your condition of peripheral neuropathy and how it affected you. Uh, about two years ago, I was noticing a little bit of numbness and swelling in my feet and lower legs. And I just thought it was a little bit of uh, circulation loss. And I started going to my regular doctors and, and you know, to figure out what was happening. And they didn't know, and they thought, okay, well, just uh, we'll, we'll, we'll take some blood work and try to figure out what's happening. Uh, but I, I kept on going back and getting more blood work and just getting more, we don't know yet, we're still trying to diagnose it. And in the meantime, I kept getting worse and worse. And finally, someone says, I think you have some neuropathy going on. And that was news to me. I didn't know what that was. And I researched and found out that that's why I'm losing feeling in my legs and feet and even numbness in my fingertips. The frustrating part was uh, my doctors were telling me what was happening, which I already knew, but they didn't tell me why it was happening. And they weren't giving me treatments as to my condition. And it happened to be the first part of July, up here of 2016, that I saw an ad uh, from Dr. Johnson and his chiropractic clinic in Shelby Township. And I was familiar with Dr. Johnson because I had seen him a few years earlier for several months for nutrition evaluation. And I thought, well, he helped me then. Now that I see he's doing neuropathy treatments, maybe he could help me now since no one else has volunteered to help. Uh, Brendan, talk about uh, the neuropathy, how it affected just even your mobility getting around. What happened to you? There was a time where I was walking and my toes and feet could not actually feel the, the pavement or the carpeting or something. And if I wasn't careful and I wasn't looking, my shoe, my foot sole of my shoe, might not notice that there was a rise in, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the flooring or the, the surface. And when my shoe would hit there, because my toes and feet did not feel it, I would tumble because I had no feeling there in my feet. And that is quite um, inconvenient. <laughs> When, when you need to have two people help you up because you don't have the strength in your legs and feet to do it yourself. Let me ask this, Brandon. When, in fact, you first came here, how, how soon was it before you uh, started having some, notice some difference in the numbness of your feet? It was probably, I would say maybe just two to three weeks with the treatments. That, I, that I, I was noticing I was getting the feeling back. Now, however, the treatments that I was getting with Dr. Johnson was improving my muscles, my legs, and my mobility from the first day. So every single day that I came for treatments, I was better, every day. Okay? And the, the benefit was that even if the feeling was delayed getting to my legs and feet, I knew that I was improving. And then once I felt the sensations and the tingling coming back, that just felt wonderful. Let me ask you this. Uh, talk about what it feels like. What's your experience of what it feels like uh, in your particular case? When, I've, when I started the, the treatments, uh, I was apprehensive because I did not know if the feelings in my legs and feet and my fingertips would come back. My fear was that it would progressively get worse and I would actually be wheelchair bound. And I really hoped that would never happen, but I had no idea on how it could be reversed. But uh, consulting with Dr. Johnson and looking at his, uh, his uh, materials and his, uh, his equipment and the uh, testimonies of other people that had went through his treatments, I thought, I, I have to try this. So uh, I, it was, I'm not, I don't know if it was a last resort, but I thought, 
this is the first resource that I have found that could hopefully make me better. And it did. So it was been a, it's been a four month uh, treatment process twice a week. And my feelings in my legs, for example, uh, my, my right leg and left leg went from like a 56% and 66% uh, sensation that I had remaining. They are now at around 75 and 80%. So I've had a lot of improvement in just four months. My stride is better. Uh, I can walk heel to toe instead of drop foot. My balance is better. So I'm just, my, and then maybe my fingertips are better so I can be better in my work. So, I mean, it's a, it's a, it was a lifestyle change and uh, for the better, and I really, it, it was just a good improvement. Now, not only just the treatment, but also the diet, uh, improving my diet to help my condition and, and uh, in eating according to my blood type and making things better because what, I eat affects my neuropathy. So I'm feeling a lot better and healthier now. Mm -hmm.